the UCA Film Department hosted their postponed film festival last week to honor the film students and their work over the past semester. The UCA Film Festival has been going on for over 10 years and is a staple in the film program at UCA. We sat down with Chris Churchill, a film professor at UCA, to tell us more about the festival. When uh, the campus was closed down because of the pandemic, uh, we decided to cancel the festival. Uh, we couldn't really figure out the best way to uh, kind of host a virtual option in the amount of time we had before the semester was over. So uh, we decided to postpone. Uh, and so we're doing the festival now in December instead of in, in May. Because of COVID, the film festival was held online. Churchill spoke to us about the process of a virtual festival. It's, it's a little bit different. Um, I think that the process, the way that uh, we um, uh, are, uh, we selected the films and the, kind of the way the festival all went together is really no different. Um, but uh, instead of meeting, you know, usually our fest, uh, we, have the, we have the screening in um, Reynolds Performance Hall. Um, uh, since we're in a pandemic, that's obviously not a possibility. And so we've uh, decided to uh, host it on an online platform uh, where everybody can get together and all at the same time kind of celebrate the work of, of our really great film students. The COVID guidelines administered by the CDC for filmmaking are lengthy and can make filmmaking a very difficult process, but that did not stop filmmakers like Kristen Barker while making her film Marooned during the pandemic. She spoke with us about what she learned about filmmaking during a global crisis. With COVID, a lot of planning has to be done on the front end. That's preparing for, you know, sanitation, um, social distancing, making sure that everyone is taken care of and feels comfortable on set once you get there. So, like I said, lots of preparation on the front end, lots of organizing. Remember to wash those hands, wear those masks, and watch some good films. From News 6, I'm Connor Holmes.